Hello loves and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with an ASOS haul. Again, I've just been shopping like a lunatic. This literally just came like two seconds ago. Look at the lighting. Whoa, it just got really, really bright all of a sudden. I thought I would get some bits and bobs for the cooler months because I cannot even tell you guys how many summer dresses I've got. I've got so many. My wardrobe is just full of dresses and skirts and stuff like that. So I definitely do not need anything else for the summertime. I'm completely kitted out. I'm giving up with my hair. If I look stupid, I'm sorry, but I don't want to keep touching it. So yeah. Um, so I've got some more bits and bobs for the autumn time, I'd say. This is definitely more autumn than winter. Um, early autumn at that. So I thought I would show you what I've got. I've, uh, I've done a lot of summer hauls over these past months, so I thought it would be the right thing to do is just show you some more bits and bobs that are more wintry. So the first piece I have, I am so shocked at the quality of this. This is beautiful, wow. So this is from Vero Moda, and this is in a size small, and it is this beautiful kind of minky, would you say it's a minky pink, is that what it's called? Dusty, dusky minky pink, is that what you'd call it? very 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 pretty it's kind of like a stretchy almost jersey material imagine like jersey mixed with silk and then it's got this like eyelash lace detail all around the front and like a race back detail down the back with little straps i have been needing just a few little camis i need to get this in like a white and a black as well this was really reasonably reasonably priced i think it was about 15 pounds and i just think little tank tops like this with black jeans and like a big chunky cardigan is just such a vibe um and i just think they look really really pretty and elegant and just so simple like imagine this with a pair of black skinny jeans um dior slingbacks slouch cardigan nice bag it's just like the perfect dinner outfit do you know what i mean like if you're just going to like um like a mid mid-range restaurant like not like nando's like upper tier like zz's or bella or something like that around those lines i feel like this type of thing would just be perfect to just pop in there for a meal go out for some drinks i go to stratford quite a lot with my friends um and this is the type of thing i would wear so i just needed to get a little top like this because i was looking through my wardrobe and what i've been trying to do is fill the spaces uh where i'm kind of missing things so what i had a lot of was dresses and skirts and then I realised that actually I've got a lot of dresses, skirts and jeans and then I realised actually I've got barely any tops. So there are a lot of tops in this video because I just needed, I just needed some. So I think this colour is really nice. I'm not sure about it on me. I've never had this colour clothing before. Actually it looks quite nice. I feel like my skin tone and stuff. I feel like the blush and the contour stands out more on my face and that's next to me. So that's that little top. Hopefully it fits well um, because I've needed something like that for a really long time. Next up is a pair of skinny jeans. I got these in a waist 26 leg 32. Um, I got these previously in a waist 25 leg 32 and they were just too tight on my bum. Like I felt like I was going to sit down and the whole seam was going to rip open which is really annoying because around the waist area it was really really nice. Um, but yeah I decided to take them back and get them in a bigger size. Um, these are low waisted jeans. Low waisted jeans are finally coming back in fashion. I mean I never stopped wearing them. High waisted jeans on me just make my bum look like seven miles long. It just looks like really like a massive long bum cheek. I don't think they're flattering on the majority of people. If you've got a big bum, I think they can be fine. But on the majority of people, I just think they look awful, in my opinion. Skinny high waisted jeans, that is. I think the like mom jeans and looser jeans, I've got a pair of cigarette jeans in here as well. I think they look fine um, on pretty much everybody, but... No, high-waisted jeans for me have always been a no, apart from a brief blip. But I just got these, they're like a light blue denim wash. Um, and I don't have any jeans in this colour, so I just thought it'd be a good idea to grab some because, you know, everybody needs a pair of light blue jeans. And then I, and I'm just trying to revamp my jean drawer. Um, and I thought I would get a cheaper pair of jeans to see if I like the colour, if that makes sense. Because I do usually get my jeans from Levi's. Um, pretty much all of my jeans are from Levi's or Superdry or Tommy Hilfiger. Um, but because I've never had this colour before, I thought I'd buy it and then see if I wear it and then I'll get, you know, a more expensive pair of jeans if I do like the colour. But ASOS jeans are a really, really nice quality for the price. I think they're about £30, um, which obviously isn't cheap for jeans, but compared to Levi's that are like almost £100 a pair. Um, they're really, really nice quality, quite stretchy, uh, comfortable to wear, keep their shape, keep their colour, so, yeah. This piece, I am 
so excited about. So, Helena Bonham Carter, who I absolutely love. If you don't know who she is, she's an actress. She played Bellatrix in uh, Harry Potter. Um, she released a range with Brora Cashmere. Um, and they had a phenomenal woman scarf, which I actually have, which is really exciting. I got it. Um, it was so expensive. And then I got it as a birthday gift. And I honestly almost cried. So she released that. And then she released a kind of ballet style wraparound cardigan in red. And obviously it was made out of cashmere. So very different to this fabric wise and quality wise. But I saw this on ASOS and I just absolutely fell in love. So it's a little, um, kind of like, I'd say it's like a brownie pink, almost like a lipstick shade. Um, it's just one of those like ballet cardigans. It's got the more open kind of flute sleeves and I just love this. I just think it is the sweetest little thing just with like a pair of white or black jeans and then obviously it's got the little wrap around like it's like a proper little ballet cardigan um, that you'd wear as a kid in your ballet classes. And I just, I love this. I love how these look. They just look so feminine and sweet and I just had to get it. I'm so excited to wear this. I've been looking for something like this for such a long time since I saw her collection with Brora Cashmere, but I just wasn't ready to spend that much money on a cardigan. So I'm so glad that I found this one. They've also got it in a light baby pink. Um, I will link this one and the baby pink one in the description for you guys to take a look at because the pink one is very cute and I think I will end up getting it, so... Yeah, keep your eye out for that. If you like this one, you'll probably like the pink one as well. Another pair of jeans from ASOS. These are the ASOS Design cigarette, um, cigarette jeans. They look very small. Hopefully I fit in there. <laughs> They're very, very small. Um, but these are their cigarette jeans. So they just go straight down. Um, I got a pair of white jeans that are kind of like a wide leg jean. And I really like them, but I feel like they just need to be a little, like a tiny bit more tapered for me and my style. Um, I feel like the wide leg jean is a little bit younger, a little bit more streetwear. If you get my, do you get my vibe? Do you know what I mean? Like I feel like wide leg jeans and mom jeans are a little bit more teen, streetwear, um, slightly more masculine. So... I did want to try the kind of straight leg jean style, um, but I, I'm kind of struggling to find ones that I like. But after I found these on the website, they're the cigarette jean. So they're very narrow in the ankle. Not as narrow as a skinny, because obviously a skinny would be like there around the ankle. You know what I mean? So there is like at least two inches extra around the ankle. But I just feel like these could be quite flattering. I'm really excited to try them on and see what they look like. Um, I feel like with a pair of heels and the right shirt, this could be dressed up in a really kind of classy, mature way that would fit my style. So fingers crossed for these. I'm really excited to try them on. Hopefully they fit. They do look very, very small. My waist is 24 inches, but I feel like you just need a little bit more room to breathe when you're wearing quite stiff. This is very stiff uh, denim. So yeah, fingers crossed they fit because I feel like they're going to be pretty much perfect for what I'm looking for. This jumper, I feel like I've actually seen on somebody, but I cannot put my finger on who it is. Um, so it's this beautiful brown, it's got kind of like um, red tones in the brown, if that makes sense. It's a, it's a really nice shade of brown, it's a square neck. I feel like square necks are very flattering and quite feminine, and you can just see the collarbone, and it just looks like, I've got quite like sticky outy collarbones, and I love that um, on people in general. I love the style of these and I've not bought one yet so I feel like I'm going to love wearing this and the quality feels really really lovely. I got it in an 8, I'm now thinking I should have got it in a 6 because it is supposed to be a tight jumper but fingers crossed it is like skin tight on me, if not I can just return it and swap the sizes. Okay I'm really excited for this one. Okay so this is a little black jumper and in the front it's kind of quite a low neckline and then in the front it wraps around into a little knot. I feel like it's going to be very hard for me to show you until the try on clip but you're about, you're about to watch that here. Um, so I got this in a 6 because again I wanted it to be very tight, I don't know why I didn't get the brown one in a 6, maybe it was sold out or something, um, but it's just a long sleeve plain black jumper, I mean I say plain, it's got the little knot at the front which I feel like just gives it the perfect amount of, you know like quirk, a little bit of detail, a little bit of something, I feel like this with like a leather skirt, a pattern skirt, jeans, could just look really really nice, um, so I'm really excited about trying this on, I feel like it's going to be a really beautiful top i might actually wear this tonight i'm going around my friends for dinner um so i kind of want to dress nicely but not over the top um but yeah i really really like this i can't wait to try it on the quality feels really nice just like a really nice quality jumper a little bit of stretch to it and that's that one i'm really excited about this one now this skirt i'm not 100 percent sure on but hopefully i like it
This was actually on sale. Um, I think it was like £60 originally, just over £60, and it is from the brand Soaked. Okay, so usually in GBP it is £59.99. Um, and it was down to like 25 or something like that. So this is the skirt. I feel like it's very different It looks so slightly big. It might be one of those ones that look big off and then um, Fit normally once it's on but I got this in a size small and I just really love the look of this It's actually got velvet where you can see the leopard print all of the black uh, When I say all of it 90% of the black is actually velvet. It's actually textured So I think that is really really cool I do really love this skirt, but the one thing I'm going to say is I feel like the orange tones in it are a little bit too bright for me. I'd love this a lot more if the tones were more brown, if they were definitely more brown than orange. But I'm going to try this on, see if I like it. I love little skirts like this, I just think they're really quirky. Just stick it on with like a black jumper and then some black boots, I feel like it can be a really cool outfit. Um, so fingers crossed this fits nicely. Um, you guys will obviously see in the try on haul. But um, but I do really like this and given the price of it, I was just, you know, I thought I might as well try it considering it was on sale for such a good price. So that is this skirt, just A-line. I love A-line skirts. I think they're the most, like, kind of classy shape you can have to a skirt. Completely forgotten what this is. Oh, right, okay, I know now. So this is from the brand Urban Bliss and it is one of those uh, ballerina style wraparound cardigans. The quality of this feels absolutely lovely really 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 nice very very soft very stretchy feels like it's going to wash really well and last a really long time um that is really really nice so soft oh my god that feels like a really nice blanket um i wonder if it's got the materials on here no but yeah this is from the brand urban bliss really really nice got it in a size eight it's very very soft it's got the little ties around the front as well so you can obviously have it as the cardigan um going on obviously it's got the little ties around the front and then it kind of like tapers in at the bottom this is just a really really beautiful cardigan i saw it on the website a couple of times and i just had to put it in my basket and get it because i just thought it was it was too nice to miss so that is everything i got from asos i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did like anything then just check the links in the description everything will be linked there for you guys um i'm really really excited about everything i got it just looks like really nice i feel like i've done a really good shop here for some pieces that are going to last me a really long time so yeah that is it for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed thank you so so much for watching and i will see you really soon with a new video bye